In the heart of the Wild West lies a town frozen in time, a testament to a bygone era, Tombstone, Arizona. There's a certain mystique that surrounds this town, a tangible echo of the past that lingers in the air. It's as if the Wild West never truly left, but rather it lay dormant, waiting for those curious enough to uncover its secrets. Tombstone, Arizona is more than just a town. It's a living, breathing testament to the Wild West era, a time of outlaws and lawmen, of gunfights and gold rushes. It was born out of silver, a precious metal that sparked a rush of miners, entrepreneurs, and fortune seekers, transforming a barren desert into a bustling town almost overnight. But as the silver veins ran dry, so did the town's fortunes, leaving behind a ghost of its former self. Yet Tombstone resisted the fate of many mining towns. It didn't fade into obscurity. Instead, it held on to its rich history, its stories and legends, and its indomitable spirit, earning itself the moniker, the town too tough to die. But there's another side to Tombstone, a darker, more haunting side. You see, Tombstone, Arizona, carries with it a reputation as one of the most haunted towns in America. Whispers of ghostly apparitions, unexplained phenomena, and eerie occurrences have long been a part of its folklore. The spirits of those who lived, loved, fought, and died in this town are said to be as much a part of Tombstone as the sun-bleached buildings and the timeless landscape. And it's in this very town, amidst the echoes of gunshots and ghostly whispers, that we find a place of remarkable significance. A place that serves as the final resting place for many of the Wild West's most notable figures. A place where history is etched in stone, where the tales of bravery, treachery, love, and loss are immortalized forever. In the heart of this town lies an unassuming graveyard, Boot Hill Graveyard, where the stories of the Wild West live on. Among the weathered tombstones, some names stand out, forever etched in the annals of history. In the heart of Tombstone, Arizona, you'll find the final resting places of the Earp brothers and their trusty companion, Doc Holliday. These names, synonymous with the Wild West, carry tales of bravery, lawlessness, and the infamous gunfight at the O.K. Corral. The Earp brothers, Wyatt, Virgil, and Morgan, hailed from a large family, but it was these three who carved out their place in history. They weren't always on the right side of the law, but they were known for their tenacity and fearlessness. The brothers were lawmen, gamblers, and at times, outlaws, with lives steeped in controversy and conflict. Then there's John Henry Doc Holliday, a man of intellect and a deadly gunslinger. A dentist by trade, Doc Holliday was more infamous for his quick draw than his dental work. His friendship with Wyatt Earp is stuff of legends, and together, they became a formidable force in the wild, untamed landscapes of the West. Their lives were intricately woven together by the events of October 26, 1881, the day of the gunfight at the O.K. Corral. This shootout, lasting all of 30 seconds, left three men dead and several wounded. It was a defining moment for the Earps and Holiday, marking them as significant figures of the Old West. In the years that followed, they met their demise, each under different circumstances. Virgil was maimed in an ambush, Morgan was gunned down in a billiard parlor, and Wyatt died an old man in Los Angeles. Doc Holliday, suffering from tuberculosis, met his end in a Colorado sanatorium. And so, they rest in Tombstone, their stories forever part of the fabric of this town. Their graves are a stark reminder of a bygone era, an era of lawmen and outlaws, of quick-draw duels and frontier justice. Their legacy lives on both in history books and within these hallowed grounds. Not all who rest here carry a famous name, but each carries a story worth telling. Our journey through Tombstone's hallowed grounds brings us to the final resting places of lesser-known but equally captivating souls. They are the unsung characters of the Wild West, each with a tale etched in the annals of this historic town. Take, for instance, Mary Catherine Horony, better known as Big Nose Kate. She was a Hungarian-born beauty who lived a life of adventure and uncertainty. She was known for her sharp wit, fiery spirit, and of course, her relationship with the infamous Doc Holliday. Big Nose Kate was a woman who defied the norms of her time, choosing a life of independence and resilience in the face of adversity. Then there's China Mary, a woman of Chinese descent who wielded considerable power in a town dominated by men. She was a successful businesswoman, running a popular general store and lottery and was known as the unofficial mayor of Tombstone's Chinatown. Her life, though fraught with challenges, 
was a testament to the spirit of survival and tenacity that defined the era. And let's not forget about George Parsons, a diligent diarist whose detailed accounts offer us a window into Tombstone's tumultuous past. His words penned with precision and care bring to life the daily happenings in this once bustling mining town, from the mundane to the extraordinary. His grave is a reminder of the quiet contributors to history, those who observed and recorded, ensuring that the stories of Tombstone would endure. These are but a handful of the many stories that lie beneath the sun-bleached stones and weathered wooden crosses of Tombstone Cemetery. Each person, whether a gambler, a miner, a store owner, or a homemaker, played a role in the grand tapestry of this iconic Wild West town. Their stories may not be as well known, but they paint a vivid picture of life and death in the Wild West. In a town steeped in mystery, it's no surprise that some stories are shrouded in the unexplained. Tombstone, a place where the past lingers in every shadowy corner, every weathered gravestone, every whispered tale. Here, we delve into the darker side of this historic town, the mysterious and the unexplained. The stories that send shivers down your spine, that make you glance over your shoulder, that remind you that in Tombstone, history isn't just a thing of the past. It's alive, it's present, it's watching. Take, for instance, the tale of The Swamper. An old miner from the late 1800s, he was said to have discovered a rich vein of silver beneath the saloon, owned by Big Nose Kate, where he worked. For years, he tunneled in secret, hoarding his treasure. But the swamper vanished without a trace, leaving behind only whispers of his hidden fortune. To this day, his ghost is said to haunt the saloon, guarding his lost treasure. Then, there's the story of a mysterious woman in white often seen wandering the graveyard, her identity unknown. Some say she's searching for a lost love. Others claim she's an omen of misfortune. Regardless, her spectral figure has been sighted by many, a silent sentinel beneath the moonlit sky. And let's not forget the chilling accounts of ghostly gunfights echoing in the dead of night. Spectral figures locked in an eternal battle, their phantasmal bullets leaving no trace. These ghostly duels are said to be the spirits of cowboys, forever trapped in their final, fatal showdown. In Tombstone, the line between the living and the dead often seems blurred. The tales of ghost sightings, strange occurrences, and unsolved mysteries are as much a part of this town's fabric as the dust on the road and the creaking signs in the wind. They serve as a chilling reminder that in Tombstone, the past isn't buried, it's very much alive. And as we've seen sometimes, it's not too keen on staying in its grave. In Tombstone, the line between the living and the dead often seems blurred. Tombstone, a town where the echoes of the past still resonate. In the heart of the Arizona desert, where the dust dances with the tumbleweeds, lies a town that time itself seems to have forgotten. Tombstone, a name that reverberates with the echoes of the Wild West, remains a place where history whispers from every corner, every weathered plank, and every aged tombstone. The town's historical significance can hardly be overstated. It was a cradle of the Wild West, a place where law and lawlessness coexisted, where legends were born and died, leaving their stories etched in stone and sand. The Earp brothers, Doc Holliday and many more, each left their indelible mark on this town, their tales still spun around campfires and in hushed tavern whispers. Tombstone Cemetery, the final resting place of these infamous characters, is a testament to the town's storied past. Amid the desert flora, the graves stand as silent sentinels, each one a chapter in the town's grand narrative, each one a tangible connection to a time long past. Yet, Tombstone isn't just a relic of history. It's a living, breathing mystery. Unexplained phenomena, whispered legends, and unsolved crimes add an extra layer of intrigue to this already captivating town. The answers to these mysteries might be buried alongside the town's notorious residents, or they might still be waiting, hidden in the shadows of the town's weather-beaten buildings. As we delve deeper into Tombstone's past, the line between fact and legend blurs, between the living and the dead, the known and the unknown. It's this blending of history and mystery that keeps Tombstone alive, that keeps its story unfolding, an ever-evolving tapestry of tales woven from threads of truth and embellished with the colorful yarns of folklore. As the sun sets on the weathered tombstones, the tales of Tombstone continue to captivate, a testament to a town frozen in time where every grave tells a story.
As we journey through the outlaw odysseys we leave behind the town of Tombstone carrying with us tales of the Wild West. We've journeyed through the dusty streets, past the weathered saloons and the aging cemetery, each echoing with the whispers of legends. The Earp brothers, Doc Holliday, and other notorious figures have graced our narrative, their stories as rugged and enduring as the desert terrain. Their tales, etched in stone and sand, have added a rich layer of intrigue to our odyssey. But our journey through the Wild West is far from over. Beyond the borders of Tombstone, other towns, other legends, and other mysteries await us. The Outlaw Odysseys is an ongoing journey, a relentless pursuit of the stories that have shaped the Wild West. As we venture further, we promise to bring you more captivating tales, more intriguing characters, and more unsolved mysteries. Our next destination? Well, that's a secret we'll keep under our cowboy hats for now. But rest assured, it's a place where the spirit of the Wild West still resonates, where history and mystery intertwine to weave a captivating narrative. Join us next time as we continue our journey through the Outlaw Odysseys, unearthing the stories buried in the heart of the Wild West. Until then, keep your boots dusty, your hat tipped, and your spirit as free as the desert wind. After all, that's the true essence of the Wild West, and the spirit that guides our outlaw odysseys. We ask that you like and subscribe to the channel for more history of the Wild West.